Today under molecular orbital theory, uh, we will be looking at a molecular orbital diagram of uh, COCl4-2-. Uh, so basically this is an example of an tetrahedral complex. Electronic configuration of uh, cobalt that is 27 is argon uh, 3d7 4h2 and in this particular complex the oxidation state of cobalt is plus 2 so the electronic configuration will be argon 3d7 4h0 and 4p0. Zero. Now in tetrahedral complexes as it does not have center of inversion uh, we are not mentioning uh, whether the orbitals are girard or ungirard and orbitals uh, will be assigned the symmetry that is s orbital will be assigned symmetry a1 uh, p orbitals are assigned symmetry t2 and d orbitals as we know it splits into two uh, that is dx square minus y square and dz square it is termed as e and the remaining three are termed as t2 so over here in tetrahedral complexes uh, we have two t2 orbitals and similarly the ligand group orbitals are also t2 and a1 uh, so over here in tetrahedral complex s that is a1 will mix with a1 and uh, it will give a bonding a1 and a anti-bonding a1 uh, while there are three t2 that is t2 p t2 d and the t2 of the ligand group so this three orbitals will combine to give t2 bonding t2 partially anti-bonding and t2 completely anti-bonding so over here there will be, be a mixing of a p and d orbital and uh, as a result uh, the three orbitals uh, that is uh, t2 of p t2 of d and the t2 of ligand will combine to give us three orbitals that is bonding partially anti-bonding and completely anti-bonding orbital while the e orbitals uh, that is uh, dx square minus y square and dz square will remain in the non-bonding state so in a cocl4 2 minus uh, there are four cl ligands uh, that would bring four pair of electrons and uh, this four pair of electrons will be donated in the bonding molecular orbital and uh, that is this four pair will go in the bonding molecular orbitals now the remaining seven electrons and uh, that is this is basically a d7 system as there are seven electrons in d orbital so this seven electrons of the cobalt uh, will be filled in this particular manner one electron will go here one electron third fourth fifth electron and then the sixth and the seventh electron will be paired in eg orbital and uh, as a result uh, there will be eg orbital will have four electrons and t2g orbital will have three electrons and as this complex has three unpaired electrons the magnetic property of this complex will be a paramagnetic complex and the electronic configuration of uh, this complex would be t2g uh, that is bonding there are six electrons and uh, then a1 bonding that are two electrons uh, then we have e sorry we are not writing g over here so e uh, there are four electrons and t2 that is slightly anti-bonding there are three electrons so this is the electronic configuration the complex is coba uh, the complex is colored and it is paramagnetic in nature so this is our MO diagram for COCL4.